We are going to do a quick review of the Jax Build and Brawl series uh, three and three quarter inch wrestling figures. Series six, Sergeant Slaughter. This is how he looks like in the package. So if you want to go look for one, the um, reason I picked this up because it's obvious. I wanted to have Sergeant Slaughter join my GI Joe team. Now, the figure itself. It's just slightly smaller than the G.I. Joe figures. You can see here, Beachhead with Sergeant Slaughter. But if you put them on the stand, right there, you see, it's slightly taller. Now, this figure only comes with a piece for the Elimination Chamber that you could build. And the head mold is actually pretty awesome. There's the iconic chin and sunglasses and the hat for Slaughter. It's too bad the hat doesn't come off. Um, he's in his wrestling attire and tights. What I was going to do is I'm going to customize this, paint it up and make it give it a little camo gear. And the other choice I was going to do was I was going to remove the head off this figure and place it on the body of Copperhead, because Copperhead's nice and big. He's got the black tank top like the original Sergeant Slaughter figure had. And I might switch, I might either keep these legs or I might switch them out, use different legs and paint them up. And, and then um, I'm going to paint into green camo like the original Sergeant Slaughter figure. And of course, I'm going to make a Sergeant Slaughter's name stand. And when I do that, I'll make another video for it. But right now, that's how he looks. Um, they got these little swivel joints like the X-Men Origins, the Marvel Universe figures by the biceps and the hips. And it's pretty posable. You can get him in a lot of crazy poses. He's got the bending waist joint. You know, you can pretty much get this into all kinds of... See if I can set this camera down. You know, you can move the legs, the knees, got the double jointed knees, so you can stretch them back all the way back. He's got the ankle joints, so he can rotate his legs. So, you can get him in extreme poses. You can split. You can do uh, funky karate kicks. I mean, all kinds of, whatever your imagination can come up, come up with. But, what's happening is, um, I heard that the major retailers are canceling this line. You might even see it at Toy, uh, Walmart, they're on clearance already, and they might even appear on Walmart. I picked this one at Toys R Us. That was the only store that actually still keeps restocking on wrestling figures it would be Toys R Us. So if you actually want a Sergeant Slaughter, this is the closest you get to a 25th anniversary one until the, you're able to get his license again and use his copyrighted Sergeant Slaughter name. But like I said, I'm going to customize this on that body and I'll make a video of how it looks when it comes out. So here's my review Sergeant Slaughter build and brawl figure by Jax.